Through the Sustainable Highlands Highway Investment Program, the PNG government has secured funding to rebuild the Okuk Highway, a significant road link that is vital for the development of the country's economy. Uh, our consultants, our engineers and us, we work together, check on each other to try and see how best we can uh, support each other to deliver this very uh, important uh, uh, highway, which is the Islands Highway. And uh, I must say that um, uh, I've now witnessed that all the contractors are <laughs> giving it their best. The Highlands Highway is undergoing a massive reconstruction from Nadzab in the Morobe province all the way to Kagamuga in the Western Highlands province. Initiated by the O'Neill Able government, the Highlands Highway is being funded at over 3 billion kina by World Bank. However, due to COVID-19 restrictions, construction work here in the Highlands provinces have been delayed for about nine months. But after a meeting with the WEX secretary and the WEX minister, the contractors are adamant that they will complete a ceiling of the road for every five kilometer per month. The reconstruction of the Okuk Highway is divided into three phases from Kagamuga to Maringo in Simbu province, Maringo to Enganofi in Eastern Highlands province and Enganofi to Nadzap in Morobe province. In Western Highlands, over 70% of the 8.2 kilometers stretch of highway from Kagamuga to Keltiga has been sealed and the road widened for the proposed four lanes. Secretary Were in a meeting with contractors in Kainantu says the reconstruction of the Highlands Highway gives young Papua New Guinean engineers an opportunity to build one of the biggest highways in the country. This is the first time we are doing a major rehabilitation and upgrading works on this uh, important leg of section of the highway covering uh, 430. I think media, is, as you have seen, you know, as we travel together, the amount of effort, the technology, the mobilization of equipment setups we have on these sections should already give out the message that the highway is going through some, you know, undergoing some major rehabilitation work. Huh? You look at the uh, retaining walls and uh, gabion culvert drainage work that the, uh, that the contractors are doing. <clears throat> These are structures that have never been built before. It's a experience and standards that we are bringing on board for the first time to see a reliable highway. Under the Connect PNG Development Infrastructure Program, the Marape-led government aims to link up all economic roads over the next 20 years, and that will be implemented through five-year phases. Yes. From 2020 to 2025, the government aims to maintain and rehabilitate existing roads at a length of 2,000 kilometers and the construction of missing links at a length of 13,000 kilometers. Thakla Gunga, National NTV News.